college football 25 ultimate team deep dive. I've yet to look at any of this. Now, I looked at the first picture and I said I'm going to do a live reaction to all of this. I know all the boys um, on, the, on the Madden are moving over to uh, college for a little bit. Some of them are doing even 365 days of it year long. But we're going to be going in. We're going to be looking at live reaction to everything i know everyone else is making this video you probably already saw three other ones but if you want to watch mine so be it so i'm not going to read through all this but i'm going to look at the pictures kind of see what we're looking at i'm so so excited for all of it so just jumping right into it the layout actually looks very similar it just looks very similar we've got training we've got points we've got currency uh let me zoom in a little bit to see a little bit better, we've got currency, which is going to just be coins. You've got season levels, so it looks like there's going to be seasons. That's cool to know. Um, lineup, item binder, set, store, catalog, and your rename team. Looking at the cards, this is actually quite nice. I didn't have a high expectation of this ultimate team because I didn't feel like many people would want to play it. They'd be looking at more of the other modes, but this actually looks really good after looking into it. It says... Um, looking into it to start the year, we have over 100 challenges providing variety and different themes to make each challenge feel unique. So that's going to be really cool. As you can see, level 14, uh, I don't know how, if we're going to be able to get that as soon as we are playing, like the day we start playing, we can get level 14, but pretty nice. Just scrolling through here. I'm not going to like sit and talk for 45 minutes. Uh, with all the coins you've earned from challenges, completing objectives, and completing or competing in various modes, you'll have a few options to use your resources. One option is head over to the marketplace and check out all the store where you can acquire packs. New players are introduced in weekly releases. Your other opportunities is to check on the auction house. Here you can exchange coins for specific play. Okay, so it's the same thing that we've been playing. Now, this is what our team is going to start off as. We know this every year in Madden. We get a 67 overall base team of whoever you like. So say your team is like... Alabama, I don't know why I said that team. That's a disgrace to my state. But your team's Alabama, whatever. You're going to get some Alabama players. They're not going to be any good, but they're going to be Alabama players. Uh, and put my highest overall rated players as my starting line. That looks new. That looks new. Pistol, prototype. That does look a little bit new. I may be a little bit lost, but generate best lineup. You know, you got that. Looking very similar to just ultimate team, uh, Madden ultimate team. So I'm not really stoked about anything right here. That looks like what the gold is going to look like. The uh, the green cards looks like what the, uh, the the gold is looking like. So I really like that. Now, we do have offense, defense, special teams, specialist, strategy, and visuals. So visuals, I don't know what that, I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. I'm probably not going to read anything through this, but that's going to be really interesting to know. Here is the offensive schemes and the defensive schemes. Boys, if you don't know, I'm actually uh, going to be streaming like all early release. I'm going to be streaming the release of the game. I'm literally going to be streaming for like 40 hours, 50 hours straight through all of early release. The only time I'm taking a break is to sleep a little bit. So be ready for that. I'm going to be streaming a lot next week. So that'd be really fun. But offensive and schemes, if you want to pause the video, you can go ahead and look through all of this. I'm not going to read through this. Uh, it's literally just offensive and defensive schemes. For the playbooks, wow, this is really interesting. This is challenges. Uh, I'm going to read this right through here in the picture. Stay unpredictable with the option offense. Earn the base option playbook by completing the first challenge in this sequence. Complete all challenges to earn a team playbook of your choice centered around the option playbook. So that's going to be really, that's going to be really interesting. We know playbooks are going to be important in your college football ultimate team journey. Not only does ultimate team feature all 134 playbooks but it also includes scheme specific playbooks with 19 total schemes we want that's going to be really really cool that's going to be really really cool i'm really excited for that team chemistry um it's you know similar to what we get we got theme teams stuff like that very similar it's going to be pretty interesting um for this we've also got that's going to be that's just putting whoever your team is whatever they've been on uh, it's pretty normal. Understanding player items, you're, again, going to be able to put abilities on these people. It looks like they're never going away. Michael Penix actually doesn't look like a terrible card to start the year. He's got 83 throw power. 80, uh, I don't know what that stands for. Sack, MAC, and then 80 awareness. With thousands of players in college football 25, it might take some effort to remember them all. So these players' items font front 
highlight key attributes based on the archetype and position of their player. Overall is a great way. Oh, this is going to be, so it's a little bit different than like just gold, elite, you know, stuff like that. There's different ra rare items, item rarities. Sorry for that. Different our item rarities. Um, with a flick of, this is a pretty cool picture. I'm going to guess that's the back of the card. You're going to be able to look at the stats. With a flick of the right joystick, you can flip the player item to see what abilities are currently equipped. And this is going to be in the auto binder. This is some really good news. Some really interesting stuff. We're not even halfway through. This is probably going to be a bit of a lengthy video. Um, I'm sorry. If you don't want to watch it, you don't have to. It's okay. I'm not going to be offended now. Uh, this going to be a Joey Bo. So we do know that we're going to be able to see all the old players, people that are in the NFL now. Um, so like uh, a Patrick Mahomes card, you know, you know, the campus hero uh, promo that comes out in mud every year. We're going to get a lot of that. We're going to get a lot of that. We'll probably have something similar to that. Uh, here uh, is going to be some abilities. I'm not going to go over every little thing. I don't want to uh, bog you down, but I do want to look at this. I have, I don't know what this is. Uh, I'm going to go and read it. Uh, ultimate Alumni, al alumni, alumni are returning to their stomping grounds in season one of college football ultimate scene. Here, the top players from previous college entries will make an appearance and give opposing fans headaches once again. Play through challenges to relive some of the biggest, brightest moments on the field. While we are at it, let's reveal the ultimate alumni player items that you can choose as a part of the last chance pre order offer. Okay, so. These are going to be people you're going to be getting from the pre-order offer. I guess if you got it before a certain time, I'm not sure. There's going to be a lot of different cards. Again, I'm not going to look through every single one of these. I don't want to waste your time. A lot of names, I'm going to have to pick him up. I'm going to have to get him. JC Lantham, I'm going to have to get you. You're a Tennessee native. You're coming to Tennessee. You're going to be great. Uh, we got some Peyton Wilson. Uh, okay, nice, nice. Conference stories of the league leading up to the season where you're highlighting incredible stories and the players who were a part of them. New challenges, players, and sets will become available. Be on the lookout for your favorite conferences and check out the challenges to relive some of the classic moments from each. Jonathan Jefferson. That's going to be a pretty nice card. Um, then we've got, in case you missed it, I'm guessing these are just challenges and the people that you can get from the challenges. Uh, you can get an 85 overall Joey Bosa. This is really, really nice. I did not have as high of expectations from this game at all. I'm just going to be honest with you. I'm really afraid that I'm not going to have time for college football and ultimate team, but I'm really excited to see where it leads us. Uh, this Joey Bosa card, just looking at it while I'm speaking, though, is a monster. A m monster. He is going to be absolutely insane. Then we do have Legends as well, so it's going to be pretty cool. Legendary All-American will be returning to campus and be highlighted during launch week with college football returning we also wanted to honor some of the legends that made us feel fall in love with the game with legendary players showing up every week this is going to be an exciting time in the college football ultimate team and you will have an opportunity to see the goats of the past matchup against today's stars ray lewis field general legend that's a nice that is a nice look to cards they look actually like real old cards that looks like a card from the 1990s that looks like a card from the early 2000s and that's what i really like about it We've got live events. I've all, we also like this. We have this in Ultimate Scene. We know what this is. We're going to really like this. I like this Varsity Pack, though. Varsity Pack, we don't know what that is. Reading under it, we got an orientation. I'm going to guess that's from just the beginning of the game coming out. Ultimate Team will celebrate college football throughout the year, and you won't want to miss anything. Head over to the Live Events tab to stay up to date. Filter to a specific program so you can see all the content at the program and all in one place. This is really just stuff we've got in Ultimate Team that we've already saw before. Of course, sets as well. We saw this in Ultimate Team. I'm not going to sit here and bog you down with that because you already know what's coming. New ways to play. That's a really interesting uh, header for this. So I'm going to go ahead and read through some of this. Um, we've covered challenges that you may be able to play, that you're going to be able to play throughout the season with your squad. Beyond that, College Football Ultimate Team offers many ways to play, no matter if you do like solo play or play solo squad up with friends. Or So this is kind of just similar to Ultimate Team, to be honest. Um, first up though, we're excited to introduce a new way to play that we call solo season. So I haven't read any of this with solo seasons. You will be able to play a season format with your ultimate team against AI opponents go five and zero in your season and get a buy for the playoffs, compete for the champion and get ready to do it all over again. Solo seasons is completely repeatable and offer great rewards as a progress in each season. Ultimate team also offers solo batters battles where we'll focus on accumulating battle score for each in win. And oh my goodness, I can't speak for each win and 
award earn rewards as you progress. Now, I really like the solo seasons. It reminds me, if you play MLB at all, it's going to remind me of the MLB mini seasons. Obviously, this isn't going to be a mini game. I wonder how hard this is going to be and how much rewards you're going to get. That's my only thought on that. I don't really care about anything else. I think it's going to be a really good addition to the game because now we're going to get some offline play. You're not going to have to play online to actually be able to make some coins. But yeah, really uh, enjoy that. For those who enjoy playing online, the college football is going to, it's traditional head to head. Uh, check out squads. That's obviously going to be the same as always. Now, if you're looking for a new way to sweat, oh, I don't like the sound of that, but I do like the sound of that. College Football Ultimate Team has a brand new experience that we're calling the Gauntlet. Every Friday, enter the Gauntlet to take on the best the, game, the mode has to offer online. Become a Gauntlet champion by achieving 10 wins, but taking two losses at your Gauntlet run. This is literally, I don't know if any of y'all play MLB. I'm sorry for quoting it twice now. This is literally just um, Battle Royale. This is just Battle Royale in, 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 in Madden, which I really like. But it's going to be able to use your ultimate team as well. You're going to have to draft people. So a ton of great rewards are up for grabs, including coins, national champion pack, and exclusive players. It starts at Friday at 1.30, so it's only going to be on the weekends. That's going to be pretty nice. Uh, it's going to be like uh, a weekend league, something like that. But... How can you enter the gauntlet each week? You can play champs during the week to earn a gauntlet entry or pay a coin entry. And champs, you'll play a minimum of 20 games against each other, but getting 16 win in current week champ, you'll be able to, That's going to be rough for a lot of people. That's going to not be for most of the regulars. So this is actually coming to the end of it, and it's. Uh, I want to look at this, though. Um, if you're working up a sweat reading this, you can cool down as we take talk about house rules. With house rules... You'll be able to play games with a unique twist to the additional traditional football rule sets. House rules. This is the same thing we have every year. Touchdown Tango. Let's see what this is. 25-yard first downs and 14 points for a touchdown. Go up by 28 points and earn the immediate win. Earn ICYMI players and packs from recurring wins. This is just going to be the house rules that we're getting for the time being. So that's literally what that's going to be. And it's going to stay until 829. So we're going to have house rules for a freaking while. Overtime, though, play the iconic college football overtime against other players. Each team gets one drive, score a touchdown, or so that's going to be another one. So here is the signing off, and, and there we have it. That's the ins and outs of college football ultimate team, what you can expect coming soon. We can't wait to see what your teams you're put together using players for all generations. For any updates coming to ultimate team, including program information, scheduling, and new players, make sure you follow us on Twitter or, or X. Thank you all so much for the passion over the years, and we can't wait to show you more during the launch stream. So I do want to announce I'm going to be streaming basically uh, my schedule. I'm going to say this quickly, and then we're going to get done. And I also want to say I have new subscriptions on the Patreon. The Patreon is going to be a little different this year. We had a little bit of an upcharge, but it's not much, and it's still very much worth it. You can still make it into a business. You can subscribe to the Patreon, learn how to make your first million coins, learn how to make your first 10 million coins, and elevate from there learn how to make coins from there, and then you can go ahead and sell the coins and turn it into a business for yourself just like I have. So Patreon uh, memberships have changed. Check that out. It's going to be the first link down in the description. Make sure you are checking that out. Um, But other than that, I do want to say I'm going to be basically streaming uh, the day that it comes out. When it comes out, uh, it's going to be early release. I'm going to stream 16th, 17th, 18th. 19th when it comes out i'm going to stream through the 19th as well i'm going to stream for probably another 12 hours after it comes out and then we'll probably end it it's probably going to be like a four day stream now i'm probably going to have maybe six hour breaks every 12 hours to 15 hours so maybe i can get a little sleep break in and some other stuff but we are literally going to be streaming for basically four days straight an accumulative total of probably a 50-hour stream in total. It's not all going to be together. It's going to be put into certain parts, boys. So I hope you all are ready for that. We're going to be streaming. We're going to be. I'm working my butt off this year, boys. So I hope you guys really see the interest in that. It's going to be some really unique things that you're not going to see on any other channel, boys. But that's going to wrap this video up. I know you saw this on everyone else's channel. Now you see it on my boys. I love you, and I'll see you in the next one. I hope you guys are excited as much as I am. I'm really hoping this can elevate my content and get me to somewhere I want to be. See ya.